Welcome to Board Game Casual, and yes, this is yet another board game shipment from Amazon. I actually forgot I ordered this one a while back when it was on sale for $7. I've gotten lucky twice in a row, for the most part games arriving without any damage despite Amazon's uh, minimal packaging, which is more than I can say for my copy of Carcassonne from them so many years ago. Ouch. So let's see how this one's packed and if I get lucky again. All right, wow, this is a bigger box than I thought it would be. And again, another game with no shrink wrap. It looks like, yep, it just is, has these, uh, these stickers to hold it closed, which is good, less waste. So more importantly, I don't see any major damage, no dents, no dings. You know, if anything, maybe the corners on the edges here, just a little bit. But those are really minor, nothing to worry about. All right, so generally speaking, another successful Amazon order. Wits and Wagers is a classic game I've never played, but I've always heard about. It's had several printings, and I believe this Vegas theme just happens to be the latest printing. So when I saw it on sale for $6.99, I couldn't resist. As much as I like heavier board games, I also enjoy games that have a wider appeal and are approachable in party situations or maybe with friends and family over who aren't big gamers, or even as a filler game in between heavy games on game nights. In this game, you'll draw a card with a numeric trivia question on it, like how many calories does chewing gum burn per hour? And everyone will write down their best guess on their whiteboard, trying to get closest without going over and then all the guesses are laid out from high to low. And this is where the fun comes in, because everyone is now going to bet on which they think is actually closest. So you don't need to worry too much about how good your guess was, because your own answer isn't as important as betting on the one you think is actually closest. The game looks like it comes with a fun mat that gives you different ways to bet, for example, on a specific number or even a range of guesses with varying betting odds and payouts accordingly. I think it looks like a lot of fun for what it is, and I'm looking forward to giving it a try. Well, I hope this gives you some insight to how Amazon packs their shipments. If you find this interesting, I've got a couple of other videos unboxing orders from Amazon, or maybe check out some of my unboxings from other retailers like Game Nerds or Harbor Loot. And if you've played Wits and Wagers, I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comments. Thanks as always for watching, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you next time here on Board Game Casual.